time to sit down in front of the camera and have a proper chat with you. I haven't sat down and spoken to you in a chatty video for a long, long time, but I've got a very important subject that I want to talk to you about today. Something really important happened on the internet about a week or so ago concerning H3H Productions. They actually produced a video called we are being sued. Now I will leave a link to that video in the description area and I'll also leave a link to another video where Philip DeFranco actually talks in depth about why this is such a bad thing for the YouTube community. Let me give you a little bit of background. H3 H3 Productions makes a, a variety of videos on a variety of topics. A lot of them are opinion based and in this particular video, they were given an opinion about another content creator and said content creator did not like what they said. So he threatened them with legal action unless they paid him a fixed amount of money or indeed unless they promoted his channel and they refused to do so. So they are being sued. This is going to court. There's going to be a jury that makes the decision and really determines the future of their channel, their content, and indeed content for everyone that creates videos on YouTube. So it's a really important subject and you should sit up and take notice. Now for me, I have never thankfully been a, a party of anything like this. Throughout my 10 years on YouTube, I have had issues where I've had a couple of copyright problems. I've also had the issue of my uh, channel being taken down temporarily many years ago. And then just recently, I did actually have the Luxury Lifestyle channel taken down for roughly about 72 hours. And I'd done nothing wrong. It was nothing to do with me being sued or anything. It was to do with my videos being used by a third party without my knowledge. That was what resulted in my Luxury Lifestyle channel problem. And it's all been resolved, thankfully. I can only start to imagine the amount of stress that the guys H3H3 H3 Productions are going through because they really do face a long two-year battle throughout this court case to hopefully get everything sorted and get the decision that they rightfully should. Now, let's just say that this goes in favour of the third party, the person who was not happy about this particular opinion-based video. If he wins the case, this means that if I make a video in the future and I talk about a piece of technology, and this is just an example, and I say something bad about it or something critical, or I talk about a TV program or a movie, and I'm critical about certain aspects of said TV program or movie, if this case is won by the plaintiff, then that means that the company that I'm talking about, the product, the TV program producer or the movie producer could actually get my video taken down from YouTube, could get my channel potentially closed down from YouTube, and could actually sue me for damages just for expressing an opinion it's really important that this president isn't set and it's a very serious situation for these guys to be in because I just truly hope that someone sees sense and actually decides the right thing. Now, Philip DeFranco actually brought this to my attention. I thank him for that. There is a link to his video in this video's description. And at the time of him actually publishing the details, he set up a fund to help these guys actually pay their legal fees. And at the time of me recording this video, it's over $100,000. Now, if they don't use all of that money, it's gonna go into a fund that other content producers can actually get access to if they find themselves in the same or a similar situation. So I'm gonna watch this with interest, and if any updates come about, then I will share them with you. But I'd be really interested to hear what you think about it in the comment section below. Please do support these guys. I'll also leave a link to the funding campaign as well. Hit like on this video and I'll see you again in another one very soon.